Okay, so Glenn's gem. Guided tour, here we go. First thing to mention, I think, is the floor. Um, it's one metre square rubber tiles, very durable, good grip. And uh, I'm glad I got those. We'll take you around clockwise. First bit of kit is the Jones machine. You can see here. Great for squats, chest press, bench press, shrugs, deadlifts, all that sort of thing. Differs from a Smith machine in that as well as the vertical movement, there's the lateral movement as well, albeit it can be locked into just vertical movement by engaging that uh, pin with the, uh, the red head on it into one of those three holes along the bottom there. Got an adjustable bench. There, but the the Jones machine, excellent bit of kit. Glad I got it. Got a pull up bar on the top as well. Here we've got a trap bar and a couple of uh, two and a half kilo training discs, which my wife and uh, uses. Um, Trap bars are dual grip, so you've got the normal thin grip, and on the other side of that, you've got the uh, the fat grip as well. Underneath there, we've got a box for calf raises and um, feet raised press ups, exercises like that. Stretching mat, just behind the dumbbells there. And this particular dumbbell rack that goes from two and a half. I beg your pardon. 12.5 kilos up to the big ones and the bottom there which are 35s uh, two and a half kilo increments on those and underneath we've got an ab wheel uh, which I purchased from Watson Gym Equipment really great bit of kit So up on the machine it on the wall here at the top we've got the fat grip pull down uh, handle underneath the thin grip and underneath that is the fat grip EZ curl bar for the uh, cable machine which I'll show you shortly and I use that for horizontal cable curls and horizontal upright rows got a couple of press up handles um, four half kilo discs to quarter kilo discs and to 0.125 kilo discs a few spring collars a couple of handles there for the cable machine trigger point massage balls very good obviously one on the top the spiky gets right into any uh, issues you may have uh, with your muscles um, there's a single ball at the back of that and the two at the front there actually join it's called a peanut um, to get each ball either side of your spine and uh, apply pressure to the uh, affected area knobbly foam roller and some fat grip uh, handles for putting on the uh, Olympic bar on the joints machine. So here we've got the discs for the joints machine and various bars. So we've got eight 20 kilo discs, we've got six 10 kilo discs, a couple of 15 kilo discs, six two and a halves, six fives, and just at the back here, we've got six 1.25s. So 
this black machine that you can see in front with the uh, the seat there is the uh, Watson Gym equipment high pulley low pulley self-explanatory decent stack on it which I labeled up myself because it never came labeled but it goes up to about 104 kilos which for high intensity training using slow smooth reps is uh, more than enough certainly for myself anyway and it and the folk that I train really nice bit of kit got some knee pads there which uh, move up and down concept to your own machine Got another adjustable uh, bench here, identical to the one that's in the drones machine. So my speaker, a bit of music while we train. So this unit on the wall contains a few attachments for uh, the Watson um, pull down uh, seated drone machine. Uh, you've got the fat grip neutral uh, pull down attachment which is a black bar there to the right of that there's the um, olympic bar then we've got the thin grip uh, neutral um, pull down uh, attachment which can also be used uh, as a, a wide grip uh, seated on the low pulley on the watson uh, machine above that Sorry, to the right of that, we've got the uh, fat grip seated row handle. Got a thin grip seated row handle there, just underneath the fat grip one. And an EZ curl bar. We've got the tricep press down V bar, rope tricep press down attachment. And dip chin station an essential for any decent gym I feel dip, uh, dip handle there which lastly brings us on to this uh, stack of dumbbells here which go from 1 kilo up to 10 kilos so 10 sets And that's it. That's what uh, we're having in Glenn's gym. I hope you enjoyed the uh, the quick tour. I should say that the um, the wall units, the trap bar, um, those attachments there, and the corner unit over there were made by a local carpenter by the name of Tom Footit. Um, very very good guy just told him what i wanted and uh, he produced them and also fitted the units really uh, really nice uh, storage solutions there okay i hope you enjoyed the tour and thanks very much for watching goodbye